Hello, welcome to another two minute script tutorial. This one is on dictionaries. So, firstly, we're going to create ourselves a dictionary. And if you've watched the last scripting tutorial I did on this, which should be uh, in, in iCard in the top right, um, then you'll know that this is what this is how you normally make a table. I've left a space between these two just because it looks nice like this. But essentially, what dictionaries are are tables that you can index using a string. So in other words, uh, if like in a real life dictionary, if you find a word in the dictionary, then you get a definition from that word. Um, and the definition is like the value you store in inside the index. The word is the index and the definition is the value. So for example, if we were to make this like a real dictionary, then say I made the word hello, then I would make it equal to a string and that string would say a greeting used uh, to communicate with people, right? This is a really bad definition, but that's essentially the essence of a dictionary. You can also represent it like this. So say I was going to define um, another word, so let's say goodbye. I can do it like this instead and say a farewell <laughs> uh, word used to say goodbye to people. And both of these can be indexed exactly the same. So if I was to say print dictionary hello, I will get this string. And if I'm printing dictionary goodbye, I'll get this string. You can also store arrays within dictionaries, and you can store dictionaries within dictionaries. So say I said words is equal to and then I make another table like this, I could then put words in here. So if I copy and pasted these words in here, I could index these words um, the s same way you index these. So say print dictionary. I know I've gone over a bit, but this is probably quite useful, so I'll carry on. Words and then dot goodbye. And that will print goodbye as well. So quickly, let's just test that out. And we can see and it says a greeting used to communicate with people, a farewell, world, a farewell word used to say goodbye to people, and another a farewell, wo farewell, farewell word used to say goodbye to people. So that's how you index dictionaries and how you make dictionaries. Um, that's pretty much all you'll need to know about dictionaries. Um, apart from what was covered in the last tutorial with the for statement, you can do the exact same thing with a dictionary. And the index, so this thing here, which was in the last tutorial represented with an I, um, is actually the index here. This is the same thing. So instead of using numbers as the index, you use words. You can use numbers in dictionaries um, because tables in Lua are all represented in the same way. So you can combine arrays and dictionaries essentially. Thanks for watching. Sorry I went over a bit, but I just wanted to get all of it in. Hopefully this uh, helped you.